The best sensation you get of changing the world is how you can create things that empower people to do things they couldn't do before. The challenge is doing something new, but not for the sake of just doing something new, but because there's a big unmet need. The research center here at GE is one of the most diverse industrial research facilities in the world. People with engineering backgrounds, physics, mathematics and modeling, artificial intelligence, chemistry, biology, imaging. I think that's the key to success and what enables us at GE to make advances that are difficult elsewhere. The research center allows you to find areas where solutions don't currently exist come up with a solution and have that solution now become mainstream. The first step in being able to treat the disease is being able to detect it and characterize it. Whether it's the physics of X-ray particle movement or magnetic fields or radio frequency fields, that understanding of signals is paramount. We're measuring every single X-ray photon and quantifying its energy. So that's giving us a much richer type of information. We have been building MRI systems that's a one-size-fits-all. But then we started thinking, why don't we have a system that's specialized? We've made ultrasound devices that are so miniaturized, they fit in your pocket and give you tremendously high-quality images that 20, 30 years ago you couldn't have dreamed of. Instead of using traditional mathematics and statistics, we start to incorporate neural networks to give even better images and even further reduce the radiation dose to the patient. Today, you cannot even think of making fundamental discoveries in sciences without digital. Software is one of the key enablers that helps us to get our parts to the high quality, high tech, high robustness that we need for those really important applications. We actually do have parts that we are printing for aircraft engines. I take a couple pictures, it generates a 3D model, I can just upload the thing and print one. We're building a whole new class of robotic systems leveraging AI that can actually go in and do the inspection, do the maintenance and the repair, which you could think of as minimally invasive surgery for complex machines, pointing to this concept of zero unplanned downtime. Imagine you have a set of wind turbines. How do we establish the meaning of concepts so that they could have their own capacity to exchange experiences with each other and ultimately come up with a kind of communal wisdom, if you will? With all these greener technologies and all these renewables coming in, it's like a synchronous dance. Energy storage has a huge future. We're moving away from the use of permanent magnets and leveraging the same superconducting technology used in magnetic resonance imaging. If we can eliminate the usage of the permanent magnet, then we save cost and we can improve the machine performance really unlocking the novel crossover applications is one of the big benefits of the, the GE research team. You have all these deep experts together trying to solve some of the toughest problems that have never been solved before. What we are doing is just the beginning of something. We're just scratching the surface. Because the problems are just so compelling and engaging and interesting and hard. When you bring this collective team together, there's just something magical that emerges from it. That's how you know you're in an area where you have the potential to change the world.